friends, this is Robert at Daybird Aviaries. I know this isn't showing up very well. I found this at the thrift store. I was able to get this for 79 cents. This is an unpainted, unfinished, very lightweight, supposed to be a wine box, some something to package a bottle of wine in. This front opens and closes. There's this middle partition with a hole in it. You shove the wine bottle up in there, close it. Anyhow, it's brand new. It's perfectly clean. It has never, looks like it has never been used for anything. It has a nice little rope handle on it. I'm not a big fan of ropes for the purpose that we're going to use this for, but we're going to use this for a bird toy. The kids have found some little plastic cups, and I know that's not showing up very well. But there's just some some plain uh, Cheerios in there, and that they're gonna put that they put that there in the top section, and down here in the bottom they have stacked up these little clear cups, and they have put a grape into each one. So the cups can't come out. They're gonna the, we're gonna give this to the macaws. A couple of things are going to happen, uh, are, are a couple of options. The birds are going to ignore the food and just start chewing on the wood and the whole thing's going to collapse and fall to the bottom of the cage. Or the birds are going to see the food, they're going to eat the grapes out of the top of here. I'm not sure they're going to be able to see the, the Cheerios in there. And the birds may or may not realize that they have to pick up these other cups and somehow dump out the grapes that are in there. I know this is probably the most horrible video ever, but... It is what it is. Um, but yeah, that's a cool little thing. We're going to hang this in the cage and I'll update you in, in a little bit, I guess. Oh yeah, have we mentioned that Moose now has a roommate? That's right. Rainbow, the scarlet macaw, has come inside to live with Moose. Hey, sweetie, can you turn that light off in the hallway back there? Okay. Okay. You're whining like Miss Jennifer again. There. Now the birds show up better, not being backlit. It's really now Moose is a four-year-old blue and gold macaw. I met Moose a couple of times when he was a tiny little baby. A friend of mine had him and was no longer able to care for him due to some some PTSD issues with her husband and that is totally understandable and totally acceptable. There is absolutely no shame in that. So Moose came to live here and we love Moose. You know that we love Moose and Moose is going to stay with us forevermore, happy ever after. Rainbow up here is a scarlet macaw. He was hatched at a friend's house and we raised him from the time that he was just three or four days old and he he grew up here in this very room where he's at in our home much loved um, and then he went to live with a different friend for a while an elderly friend and she is She's actually, she actually lives here with us now, and so all of her birds live here, and she, um, Rainbow has lived outside in the aviary with some of the other birds, but he has never paired up, he, he hasn't picked out a mate outside, and so we were asked to bring him back inside, and so now he lives inside in this huge cage with moose they had never met before. But we, he, he climbed right into the cage with Moose and they are just... Well, you dropped that, didn't you? Uh-oh. They are just as happy together as can possibly be. Now let's come back down here. Moose has found the toy. He is eyeing the grapes. Let's see if I can get him started. You want a grape? Now he calls all fruit good apple. You want a good apple? Huh? You want a good apple? Look at that. Do you see the good apple? How are you going to get that good apple? 
Now, of course, if they don't find the grapes in an hour or so, we will dump the grapes out and either feed them to the gerbils or the guinea pigs. Oh, we may help them, might? We might. We may, like, give them a gauge if they at least try to, try to do the toy. What do you think, Rainbow? You want to come down here and get a grape? Huh? You want an apple? Come on. You want an apple? Moose is going to get an apple. See, look, Moose is going to get an apple. Get the apple, Moose. Get the apple. Get the apple, Moose. Can you get the apple? Huh? Apple? Apple? You're not going to talk? Uh-oh, do you hear a buster? Yeah. Do you hear a bad buster? Good buster. Bad buster barking. 